Hello and welcome back to the channel. Glad to have you here. Today's video, we're going to talk about how to use the burdock leaves. Do you have some burdock leaves on hand? Usually we use the burdock root, which is more common. It's more used for liver health, but for the leaves, they all have their own healing properties as well that I would like to introduce you to. So the leaves are very potent in their uh, in their benefits as well. They contain flavonoids, tannins, as well as many other different things. And they're also rich in vitamins and minerals. And the leaves are usually very cooling. They're very drying. They're very bitter in, in a way. But don't be, um, don't be discouraged because uh, bitter herbs are very good for the digestive system. They're very good for the liver as well. So I'm sure we'll be able to disguise that um, in in other using other ingredients as well. So let's talk a little bit about the leaves. Leaves are used um, for different things, mainly to do with digestion problems. Anyone suffering from digestion problems? A, a brew of the burdock leaf might be helpful um, this way. Also, for indigestion, do you tend to have a weak digestive system? Do you tend to have digestive issues, bloating, that kind of thing? Um, generally, the leaves are used for that. And the most easiest way to use the leaves is to make yourself a simple infusion, which is like a tea form of the leaves. It's just I start simply by using five grams of the dried uh, burdock leaves. Pour that into a cup, pour over some boiling water, cover, leave aside for five minutes and you have burdock leaf tea ready to go, sweeten as you desire and drink. Um, apart from that, you can also use the leaves as a lovely pollutus, uh, pollutus sorry. Uh, you can apply it to um, any sort of skin inflammations, which include acne as well. So if you tend to have some breakouts, if you tend to have some acne, and you do have some burdock leaves on hand, just simply make yourself a, um, get yourself a pad, a cotton pad, brew some, a strong uh, uh, brew of uh, the burdock leaf tea and just soak some of that cold preferably cold onto the skin um, using that cotton pad onto the areas where you suffer from breakouts or any sort of skin inflammation that would really be useful apart from that uh, another great way that I make which is a bit time consuming to be honest but it still works best especially if you're preparing your herbal cupboard is I make infused burdock leaf oil and this oil is great because it really do, does help with any sort of skin inflammations i also include it in um in uh, recipes to make lotions and to make um uh, bars as well so to make the infused oil simple and sweet first of all choose a carrier oil of your choice whether that's olive oil um, jojoba oil argan oil as long as it's cosmetic grade and preferably organic as well and then take out the leaves preferably the dried leaves just to avoid any sort of moisture buildup or any mo uh, uh, mold formation so choose your, your dry leaves put them in a sterilized glass jar preferably a dark one just so you could um kind of avoid any sort of uh, uh, the ingredients going bad um that way once you put in your dried leaves, pour some oil over it. You can do the cold method or you can do the hot method using a double boiler that way. Um, so these are the ways that I use the burdock leaves. I hope you found this video.